So I wanted to order an Ableton Push 2. And I looked around and I looked at all the prices and the one price that seemed all over the internet was $799. I don't know about you, but $799 is not a small amount of money. So I looked and looked and looked and I finally came across a company called Toman. Maybe it's Taman. I think it's Taman. It's a German company. And they seem to have a really, really good deal. A couple of $100 less than what was being listed. And so I looked around, I did my research to see if there were any better deals out there, or if this was a legitimate company, or if people had been scammed, or what had been going on. I found a few negative-ish kind of reviews. Most people were saying it was pretty decent. Some people had been charged additional customs charges. Some people had gotten some bad packages, um, had some trouble with UPS. Um, over the course of the last eight or ten years, I looked at the different reviews and it was across the spectrum but i really didn't want to pay 800 dollars so whew, i rolled the dice and i placed the order on last wednesday it is currently it is monday right so this order came from germany and it arrived here today at three o'clock i ordered it on wednesday around 10 o'clock in the morning so not too bad in terms of shipment and this is what i got so, right here, there we go. Yeah. There. So, all in one piece, you can see the packaging, no no damages, no, no scratches, no scuffs, really nothing to be noticed. Um, got this here from, uh, from UPS just about 30 minutes ago. So, I'm gonna open it up, see what happens. I have invoice here, I'm not gonna show you that. You don't need to know my personal information. No additional charges so far, at least. So let's move on. Open it up and let's see what we have inside. So open up all the heavy duty little packaging here. Pretty good, pretty good packaging. Uh, a little bit of stuff right there. Fun. So we're going to get to the good things inside of it. Hi there. The thing that I was waiting for. And also, weirdly enough, a coloring page. A coloring page. So that's a thing. It's, it's a beautiful thing. Now you'll notice that there is a slight bit of a blemish right here. It is not through the box. It is nothing like that. It's just kind of an indentation there. So nothing damaging on the box, on the back, on the sides on the front, on the side, and on the bottom. So nothing nothing significant to be worried about there. So let's see what it looks like on the inside. Inside is all of all of that. There we go. So nothing damaged, nothing in strange condition. I'm not gonna spend all the time opening it. I will do this. I'll take it out and show it to you. So I'm excited. I'm excited. Mm. Top. And again, all well packaged. Let's see. Scared to take it out. So there it is, all nicely wrapped. All of the accoutrement inside. So there's the push to itself. I'll set that aside here. And all of the pieces that come with it. So, I haven't received any bills in the mail for custom yet, so who knows? I did check the invoices. Uh, I declared the proper amount of value. You are allowed a certain amount of value, like $800 to $1,000 declaration when it comes into uh, the United States from another country, so I don't foresee any of those uh, charges coming across. Maybe if you were to order a package that was worth more money, something maybe on the order of $1,200, $1,400, $1,800. Maybe in that case, you would look at paying some customs fees because that's potentially over the amount that you're allowed to declare. For me, no problem. Under $800, um, I won't tell you the exact price because it's probably not appropriate, but it was really good. It was like, for real, it's good. Like, um, not much more than a used unit would have been. Um, not much more than an old push would have been. So, uh, yeah, that is, that's it. So, best of luck to you. I recommend it. 
so far. Anything bad happens, I'll let you know, right? If I get into this and like $5,000 worth of customs comes in, I'll update. So, Toman, good company. Bye-bye.